what is up my original bagels and welcome to rant wednesday so if you don't know what this is this is a series that i do on and off at times about random things that kind of either affect me or i just want to give my views on so on this rant wednesday it's about drama alert and killer keemstar or dj keemstar whatever people want to call him so he wow it is drama alert is just under it is an understatement he had a massive mental breakdown on twitter he ran two or three polls saying should i go back to um making videos and everything and all 60 percent of people said no in the second one and i think it was like 58 to 59 almost the exact same said no in the first one and he he then went on to put out guys i am not doing fucking drum alert anymore and all this shit and then he comes back then he's gone again then he's gone then he's gone and he's back and forth back and forth so he's staying but i don't really know what's going on he has given his channel to another guy and i think he'll be better at doing the news because he seems like he isn't kind of uh, a dickhead in a way i know i'm kind of i know yeah i'm calling him dickhead and he has been given out a lot of shit about people and lots of youtubers have been coming forward with stuff on him there was a video two videos i think it is now that leafy is here did and just everything in it is just absolutely crazy what he was saying he told alex to kill himself to uh excuse me to get cancer uh that he's only in it for the views or the money that he doesn't care about the fans and everything like that and that it's just it's it's absolutely crazy to see it and he also called a person dan word if anybody knows what dan word is well uh, i presume everybody knows what the n word is and that was that was crazy that was mad and to be honest he really is a terrible person for doing this kind of stuff he leaked someone's uh, information i think it was their skype information just because they were chatting shit about him but it was everything that your man was saying was the truth and this is just really really stupid that a person can do this and leak their information like it does not make sense if someone is attacking you you don't go oh i'm gonna leak your information and everything you just do not attempt to like hit back at them and i think that's why this guy should not be on youtube i think keemster should not be on youtube because he's a racist and he just he's manipulative manipulative with people like he was trying to get people on his side and trying to spread shit about other people and just the news isn't really great like he has destroyed so many people's youtube channels and really he destroyed tobuscus or toby games or whatever the fuck his name is now destroyed his channel and his image that he worked years on and yeah okay giving the news out to people is good and all but if it's going to destroy someone's career why do it like i don't get that he has basically destroyed so many people's careers he made an old man break down on stream crying and if i was him i would have sued that ass off the off keemstar for doing it that is just crazy like he physically made a person cry by sending all his little nine-year-old to 12-year-old haters over there that he can just 
control and give pure all out abuse to and it's just not good for people and I feel like he is literally the cancer of YouTube and it's people like him that should not be on it because he cannot change his ways now there was a person years ago he's still on YouTube Jay Nasty that he was a pub stomper live streamer and he was getting massive in modern war for three and he was the cancer of youtube but he changed so much and matured so much that people kind of like him now i don't particularly like him anymore like him because of shit that he's done and it's the same with keem sir like i had i didn't really have respect but i liked watching his content and now i don't watch his content anymore just because of it and it's just sad to see a, a unique idea being tarnished by someone that is just a pure all out cancer like he will latch onto you and just try and turn you against people that is the kind of person he is and it's just it's really sad to see a person 30 or 40 years of age i don't know what age he is to do this and i think it's really really sad that he's allowed on youtube and i'm surprised youtube have not just tried to shut him down and twitter should have just banned his account and got rid of him off internet off the youtube and off twitter forever but yeah that's kind of my opinion i just i do not like him anymore and I don't like what he's doing and what he's done in the past as well and really he should not be on YouTube or Twitter or Hitbox or Twitch or uh, whatever them like all the live streams YouTube YouTube gaming he should not be on any of them anymore and I just don't think he should be allowed to do anything with youtube videos twitter anymore because he is just a terrible person and that's why youtube gets a bad name is because of people like him like everyone that he's exposed fair enough yeah they're it's good that he exposed some of them but some of these people have made years and years of their life to youtube and just to have it destroyed in a matter of minutes hours and just this it it'll just mentally destroy someone that people do this and i just don't find it good that he should be still on youtube and he's just he's just not a nice person i don't know him personally but what i've read from his tweets from other people's tweets from other people's videos especially leafy is here oh, i know leafy is here is a pure psycho or not a psycho geez, a cyber bully and everybody kind of hates him and everything but like he the reason why he is hated is because he gives so much true and to be honest, I kind of believe what he's saying about Keemstar because of videos he's put in. He's put nothing but proof into his videos. And he's just exposing him for just being the cancer of YouTube, really. But yeah, that is it, guys. I hope you like, favorite, and subscribe. And peace.